Hey, good morning, everybody. How y'all doing? This your boy, Rob Thomas Jr. From the real news behind the news. Oh, yeah, man. Today is uh, Wednesday, April 24, 2019. Y'all forgive me. I'm kind of tired. I woke up not too long ago. Just dropped a little big head boy off at school. But in this video... I want y'all to uh, go ahead and click on that link that you see in the description section of this video and tell me what you see. Now, I did a video last night after watching um, this video a couple of times. And at first, I thought Anthony Childs, as he was running, uh, might have had a pistol. But it, it appears to us, and after talking to certain people who know a lot more about it, this dude was running, holding, he was holding his pants up as he was running. Now, when you look at the video, the officer, once he got, uh, you'll see Anthony Childs run across the uh, screen from the dashboard camera. As he runs across, the police officer stops his car and gets out. And from that moment, the dashboard cam is switched. It's like the police officer deliberately switched the camera from the forward angle to back in the police car. So what we are seeing is a young man running from the police. The police jumps out the car and turns the camera around so you can't see what happened. From there, this is how the a sequence went. You heard two, three shots. Then you hear a pause. Then you hear three more shots and a pause and then three more shots. First of all, they told us that Anthony Childs fired the first shot. And according to the coroner, when Anthony Childs fired his first shot, he shot himself in the chest. So why was all those other shots necessary? And ask this question. Pay attention to that video. Did all those shots come from the same gun? Because from what we are hearing, every shot was fired was, it sounded like the police fired. Now keep this in mind. We're not here to judge police because we try to, uh, we, we need, um, a strong relationship, citizens and police. But at what point do we as citizens hold the police accountable? Especially if the police is murdering citizens. Now again, go back and look at the video. You can click on the link right here. Guess what? They say they had 30 videos. Of the incident. This is what they told us uh, Shreveport Times. Because the Shreveport Times called me asking why is they charging $10 or whatever per video. So if you got 30 videos and you told us you got definite proof that Anthony Childs shot himself in the chest as he was running from the police, then they need to show us something other than this video here. Because this video that they just released or that we got access to right now shows us somebody being murdered by the police. It does not show us where Anthony Childs is alleged to have shot himself in the chest. Hell no. Nah. What we see is the police getting out the car, turning the camera around so nothing can be recorded. Again, I'm not here to judge police, and I'm not trying to get the public um, irate at the police, but I am asking the public, to hold those police officers who were involved, namely Officer Travion Brooks. We're asking that the people hold them accountable. Because when you look at that video, that boy was running. He was holding his pants up. Again, if you got a pistol and you got it on your mind to shoot at the police, why are you going to take off running before you shoot the police? Shoot at the police. Please, people, don't shoot at the police. If you got a gun... I mean, don't come outside with it because the police are killing people, man. That boy did not have a pistol from what we see in that video. That boy was running and he was holding his pants up. That officer got out the car and from what we're seeing in the video when you put it together, he the one who fired all the shots. But they telling us this young man shot himself in the chest in the process of running. This is very important, people, because what we have here is a possible murder and cover-up by law enforcement of a, a citizen by law enforcement. So y'all go ahead and check that video out, man, and uh, tell me what y'all think. Hey, y'all be blessed, man.